Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Hush, hush now, little Ember. Shh, shh, shh. Everything's going to be fine. How is everything going to be fine? We're abandoning our baby. It's the right thing to do. Uh, they'll never understand. But, but she's our baby. <laughs> wee, wee. Shh, shh, shh. Ember, everything's going to be fine. You'll see. Your new family will love you so much. I did you want to do it, That's right, baby. You be a good girl now for your new mommy and daddy. And just know, your mother and I will never, ever forget you. Be ready to run, honey. I I'm about to ring the doorbell. I can't leave her. We have to. We have to. Okay, I rang the doorbell. Run! She'll have a better life, honey. I promise. I hope you're right. I miss my baby already. Oh my gosh, I'm actually on time today. Congratulations. This is the first time in history that you're not going to get detention. <laughs> oh, very funny. You think that my achievements aren't amazing, but I think they're really amazing. Yay, Molly, you're not getting detention. You're doing what you're supposed to. Daisy, why are you so in my face right now? Oh, sorry, I was just a little too close, but I wanted you to hear me clapping and, a, and, a, and applauding for how amazing you are for just being a mediocre student. Hey, I think I'm a pretty good student. I mean, I showed up today, isn't that enough? Ay, 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 Molly. Good morning, class, good morning. Everybody, please take your seats. Whoa, Molly, you're on time. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you. All right, take your seats, everyone. I have an announcement. New student today. I want you to all be very kind when she comes in. And, you know, if you wanted to be her friend, ask her to sit with you at lunch, that would be so nice of you. I bet the new student is a total loser. Um, Sarah, that's not very nice. Everyone, say hello to Ember. Ember? What kind of weird name is that? Well, I think it's a very cool name, Sarah. Quit teasing her, Jeeper. She just got in the classroom. Hi, everyone. I'm Ember. Um, this is a new school for me, so I'm, like, a little nervous because I don't have any friends here or anything. But I hope that I can be friends with you guys, if that's cool. Yeah, we'll be friends with you. Her face and her makeup are, like, really weird. Uh, Sarah, I would like you to go see the principal now. What? What did I do? You're being very rude to the new student. Sorry about that, Ember. No, it's okay. I'm used to it. I've started over at, like, five new schools now. Five new schools? Wow! You move around a lot. Are your parents in the military or something? No. <laughs> it just never really works out for me at any of my schools. Oh, well, um, I'm Molly, by the way, and this is my annoying sister, Daisy. I'm not annoying! Don't listen to her! Well, hi, Molly and Daisy. Our best friend, um, Brookie Cookie, is not here today because she has a stomach flu, and basically she's sitting on the toilet all day. At least that's what she told me. Molly, are you sure that Pookie would want you to say that? Hey, it's the truth. <laughs> oh, sorry about your friend. Uh, would you like to sit with us at lunch, Ember? Sure, that would be great. Thanks so much. What can I get for you? Oh, hey, Large Marge. Um, let's see, got any tater tots today? No, I'm about to cut this garlic bread. Oh, is that why you got a knife in your teeth? That's kind of creepy. How else do you think I'm going to cut the garlic bread? Um, I don't know, but I'll take a piece of the garlic bread. Great, fine. Awesome. Ember, don't worry about it. Our lunch lady, Large Marge, is a little bit crazy, but she's a good cook. Except for when she makes sauerkraut sandwiches. Ew, why would she make sauerkraut sandwiches? I don't know, ask her. Ah, uh, no thanks. <laughs> she might give me one. and I don't want a sauerkraut sandwich. But I would like some Tabasco sauce. Do you have any ghost peppers and jalapenos? Holy guacamole, Ember. Now I know why you have your name, Ember. All that stuff sounds super spicy. I love fiery foods. It's my favorite. Daisy, aren't you going to eat school lunch? Absolutely not. That stuff will clog your arteries quick. 
potato tots. Ay, ay, ay. I need to live forever so I can make the most amazing science discovery. Don't mind my sister. Like I said, annoying. Oh, very funny, Molly. So, Ember, what do your parents do for a living? Oh, um, well, first of all, I guess I should say I'm adopted. What? That's so cool. Yeah, I don't really know who my real parents are. I was left on the doorstep of a, as a baby at my adopted parents' house. Say what? Just just abandoned there as a sweet little baby? Are you serious right now? Yeah, but my adoptive parents are super cool. They're a little strict though, but you know, it's okay. Do you ever wonder why or how your parents just like uh, left you there? I wonder about it all the time. Did they leave a note? Yeah, they just said, this is our little girl, Ember. We can't keep her. Please take super good care of her. Wow, that is amazing. Oh boy, here comes Sarah. Ugh, look, it's the new loser student who's got a weird face and a weird name and everything's weird about her. Ugh, I'm gonna post about this right now. You better not, Sarah. Don't be rude. She's a new student and she's really nice. Whatever. Uh, okay, I'm gonna take a selfie first because I look great today. Actually, I think she kind of looks a little grumpy, but you know, it's just me. Well, why don't we take a picture of Ember so I can show everybody how weird she is. That's not very nice. Take that back. Not a chance. Don't worry, she's just being a bully. It's what she does. I don't I don't like being bullied. Take that back. Weirdo. I'm not taking it back. You're a weirdo. Take that back! Uh, Ember, are you okay? What? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just getting really angry. Um, I think you might want to just cool it down a little bit. What is going on with your eyes? They look like they're on fire. Oh, uh, this is weird. Yeah, take back what you said to me, bully. No, you're still a weirdo. And I think you're kind of ugly, too. Take it back. Ah! Oh my god! Ah, uh, somebody get some water! Ember's on fire! Okay, I just gotta look for that janitor bucket. It's around here somewhere. Got it! Just gotta fill it up with some water. Why won't the sink turn on? Okay, well, toilet water it is, you know. Beggars can't be choosers. Okay, got it. Ember! Ember, I've got some water! Everything's gonna be okay! Molly, stand back! I've got the fire extinguisher! Okay, that's that's probably better than the toilet water. Hold still, Ember! What are you guys talking about? I like being on fire! Now take back what you said to me, bully! You need to calm down, Ember! You're gonna burn the whole Brookhaven school down! Ah! Don't spray me! I don't like water! Uh, I... I'm sorry, I think I let my anger get the best of me. Um, the Sarah, I think you should probably leave now. Whatever, weirdos. Ugh, I knew there was some reason for me to just, like, not like you guys at all. Okay, that's fine, just go! Ember, are you okay? What happened? Um, I'm not really sure. It just, it happens at my other schools, too, when I got a little mad. O-M-G, is that why your parents keep moving you to new schools? Yeah. They don't know why I turned to fire. Wow, I think I might know. Really, why? I'm taking notes for my science experiment when I come over to my laboratory after school. Daisy, she's not your science experiment. Well, she could be. Daisy, get your head in the game here. Um, okay, so I, I'm just asking her, is it okay if I just like poke you with some needles and- Daisy! Okay, fine. Molly, what's your answer as to what's going on here? I think her parents wear elements. What? Yeah, don't worry. If we find your parents, we can get all of the answers. Well, I don't know. I mean, they're going to be really hard to find. We have no choice, Ember. We have to find them. And you have to try to control your anger. Especially when someone calls you weird. Well, I don't like being called weird. <laughs> Nobody calls me weird. Uh-oh, she's starting to smoke again. Let me get the fire extinguisher. Ember, try to control your anger. Can you do it? Think about happy things. Puppies, kittens, and, 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 um, pizza. Okay, I think I'm calming down now. Good, see? You can control it. This is good. Now, we just have to find out where your parents are so we can figure out what, what are you? Well, she's obviously the element of fire, duh. I could have told you that one. <laughs>
of kindergarten will be like. I don't know, Molly. I think it might be really fun, though. I hope so, because I like to do things like look at books, and I hope they teach me how to read. Yeah, they definitely will teach you how to read. I'm sure of it. Hey, look, there's my big girls. I can't believe it. Tomorrow's your first day of kindergarten. Oh, I feel a little happy and a little sad. Oh, you're not babies anymore. Why is mom crying? I don't know. She said she feels a little happy and a little sad. Probably because she won't see us all day. That's exactly right, Molly. Ah, but time to wipe my tears because I'm so excited for you girls. Are you girls excited? I am. I can learn how to read. Oh, you are going to learn how to read. Are you excited, Molly? I'm really excited because I get to eat school lunch and I heard their pizza is delicious. Of course you'd be most excited about school lunch. Okay, girls, well, I need you to hop into bed. It's getting late and you don't want to be tired on your first day of school. Good night, girls. I love you. I love you too, Mom. Love you, Mom. Wow, my first day of school. Can't even believe it. Night, Molly. Night, Daisy. <laughs> Girls, wake up. It's the first day of school. What? It's not even light time. It's not even light out yet. That's what I meant to say. Too tired, I can't even talk. Come on, girls, you have to wake up or you're gonna miss the bus. It's the first day of kindergarten. Oh, yeah, today's our first day. Daisy, wake up. I'm already awake, Molly. Ow, stop stepping on my toe. Sorry, <laughs> just really excited. Okay, girls, come on, let's go have breakfast. The school bus will be here in 20 minutes. Oh yeah, don't forget to put your school outfits on. Oh boy, my new outfit. Okay, I put my school outfit on. Molly, we're big kids now. Yeah, totally. Kindergarten. I like your outfit. I like your outfit. Come on, let's go have breakfast. I'm so excited for school. It's gonna be so much fun. Mom, I'm ready for kindergarten. Mom, look at me. Look at, look at, look at, look at. Oh, you look adorable. Okay, here. You know, just each take a banana because the school bus is pulling up right now. I want an apple. Okay, fine, whatever. <laughs> Have a good first day. I will. Wait, I don't see the school bus. Oh, wait. <gasps> ah, it's down the street. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Daisy, hurry. Coming, bye. Good morning. Oh, you almost missed the bus. Yeah, I didn't miss it, though. I didn't miss it. Um, You can't ride up there, sweetie. <laughs> you have to ride inside the bus. Why are you dressed like that? Well, I was going to be a NASCAR star, but that didn't work out, so I'm just living my dreams as a school bus driver. All right, everybody, first day of school, here we come. Oh, no, it's too early. Molly, get up, don't hit that snooze button, you're gonna miss the school bus. Don't care, don't care, so tired. But maybe if you didn't stay up all night playing Roblox, you wouldn't have this problem. Ugh. Ugh, so tired. Can't get up. Can't wake up. Are you sleeping in your school clothes? Why did you do that? Because I don't want to take the time to actually get ready in the morning. That takes way too much time. Ew, Molly, gross. Daisy, what are you wearing? My Billy Eilish shirt and my Harry Potter inspired glasses. What are you wearing? Your braces? Yeah, but not by choice. Ugh, everyone in middle school is going to tease me when they see these. You mean call your metal mouth, brace face? Yeah, did you have to, like, bring that up, Daisy? Well, I'm just saying that's probably what they're going to call you. Thanks for making me feel better about it. I'm going back to bed. Molly, don't you dare! <sighs> Molly, are you just pretending to be asleep? No, not at all. Molly, you can't skip school just because you got braces. Oh, look, there's the school bus. There's no way I'm going to get down there in time now. Oh, looks like I missed school today. Oh, well. What am I going to do with my day today? Maybe I'll have some popcorn. Wait, I can't have that because I have braces. 
Maybe I'll have some like candy. Oh wait, I can't have that because I have braces. Molly, what are you doing? Did, did you miss the school bus? Um, uh, the school bus missed me. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Well, good thing you got that new bike because you're gonna do some pedaling. What, I have to ride my bike to school? Um, I can't go to school today. Yes, Molly, you're going to school. But it's the first day of middle school and I have these ugly braces. Why did I have to get them? Like, seriously, because your teeth were crooked and you needed them. Consider yourself lucky. Braces are very expensive. And you're a lucky kid that you got them. Lucky? Look at my face! Ugh! Molly, don't worry. Lots of other kids will have braces. Now, get on your bike and get rolling. Oh, man. First day of middle school is going terribly. If A plus B equals C times D, then what will E equal? Oh, algebra. <sighs> you are so difficult. Excuse me, I'm here to be seated, please. Oh, sorry, uh, I'm working here and I'm also trying to get all my homework done. Wait, are you my old bus driver? Oh yeah, how are you? I'm doing good, here, come right over here. You can sit in this last booth if you want. Sounds good. You still think you're gonna be a NASCAR star? I sure do. Never give up on your dreams. Never ever, Molly. I don't plan on it. <laughs> um, okay, so what do you be having? Um, I'll have a cheeseburger, some french fries, and a chocolate milkshake. Okay, would you like whipped cream on your chocolate milkshake? Absolutely. <laughs> Who doesn't? You'd be surprised. Some people want raisins on their milkshake. Ew. Oh. Okay, um, so I just gotta make this food, and I've gotta finish up my algebra. So I'll do the algebra first. Okay, so when I do this, this equation. Hello, is anyone gonna bring me my food? Oh no, I forgot about our food. Okay, I just gotta prepare it really fast. Never mind, I'll just go to Starbucks. Ugh, terrible customer service. Sorry, I'm trying to juggle it all. Oh man. My boss is gonna wanna fire me now. And I really need this job because I have to save up for college. Oh, good thing the diner's about to close. Oh, so tired, so tired. I wish I could go back to, to middle school or even elementary school where I didn't have so much homework and so much work. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, hey Marley, how was work? Oh. So bad, and I didn't get all my algebra work done. You know, Molly, if you had paid attention in elementary and middle and most of high school, you would have got scholarships like me. Then you wouldn't have to pay for college. Whatever, this is how I did it. No, 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 I have to just live with it now. Oh, I have to go to bed. I'm so exhausted. Molly, aren't you gonna take your uniform off? No, not even, not even. Oh. It is not morning yet! It is not morning, alarm clock! Oh, I can't do this another day. This is too much pressure! I hate adulting! Oh, I'm gonna go back to being in kindergarten. I'm going back! I'm going back! Good morning, Molly! Whoa, someone woke up on the wrong side of the bed. Whoa, Molly! Ew, what's that smell? It's Molly. She didn't take a bath after she came home from the dino. Then she wore that as pajamas. Ew, Molly. Ah, no one talk to me. Oh, look, the bus is here. Have a good day, to girls. I am never going to have a good day ever again. Oh, that's a bit dramatic, Molly. You know, Molly, all you have to do is turn that frown upside down. Daisy, don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. Oh, here's NASCAR driver. Good morning. Oh, you're the one that gave me terrible service at the diner last night. Sorry, I tried my best. Ugh, I have the most stressful high school life ever. Don't listen to her. She's a total grump monster. <laughs> to my channel i'm daisy don't forget to hit that subscribe button guys and slam that like button 
Today I'm trying to escape baby crazy, but he's so adorable. Look at his cute little eyes and his little passy. Look at his little mouse hat. He is so adorable, but something tells me he might be a little crazy just because it says he's crazy. <laughs> oh, look at this giant baby bottle. Oh, it looks like I'm in his nursery. There's bottles everywhere. There's toys. Okay, this is adorable. All right, let's see. We're in Baby Crazy's mansion. And he's trapped us in here. Naughty, naughty baby. Oh, a checkpoint cookie. I love those. <laughs> and we have to try to escape his mansion, okay? He left his puzzle blocks and pieces everywhere. And he booby trapped them. I like guacamole. So far, this seems really easy. <gasps> Look it! It's the baby! He's after me! Uh, is this drool on the floor? Ah! Oh my god, he's really fast! For a baby who just learned how to walk, he's really fast. Okay, can he follow me up the ladder? No, he's just standing there. Oh, he's super cute! Oh, this is so cool. All right, um... I think I have to break through here. Uh, 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 made it! Uh -huh. hey! Sticky poo poo diapers. <laughs> this part of the game is disgusting. But that's okay because they put a cookie here, so I guess it makes it okay. No, it doesn't make it okay. It's still disgusting. Oh, wait, I'm at another checkpoint. Cookie respawn. What am I respawning? Oh, maybe the elevator if it breaks. But not me. Hey, what's going on with my hair today? Does anybody else notice that? What is, what is that? Oh, my goodness. It's ridiculous. My hair was like missing right there. What's wrong with my bangs? Um, all right. Uh, oh, an invisibility cloak? That'd be nice, but your obby's too easy for all that. Ooh, a spider web of drool. Ah! Ew, this is gross down here. This is what would happen if a baby owned a mansion. It would just drool everywhere, leave its toys everywhere. Whoa. Its toys everywhere. Because I haven't even died once yet. I'm gonna try not to die at all in this game. Now we'll probably die. <laughs> now that I said that, what is happening here? Oh, do not fall down. Oh, it's rising. Oh my God, the doo-doo is rising. Oh, this is the worst nightmare for me ever. It stinks in here. The water is rising. It's actually not water. Ah! Yes, I made it. Good grief. That was harder than it looked. Seriously, yo, people, it was a lot harder than it looked. The only hard part of the game so far. Is that robot gonna come to life? Okay, no. Whew. Thought maybe that robot was gonna try to attack me. He could have programmed the robot to do that. Boing, boing, boing. These are like floating blocks. These are kind of cool. Oh, wait, where do I go next? I think heal, then heal, then find a heal. Checkpoint cookie! Um, okay, it says that it's locked, and there's also a door over here, so I'm thinking I might have to go through here. Because, look at, when I hit a checkpoint, it gives me a cookie to eat. Ha <laughs> Oh my god, my sister Molly would be so jealous right now. I am eating so many cookies. <laughs> no, no! Oh, I was doing so good! And then, guess what, guys? I ate too many cookies, and I was too chubby to make it over that. That's okay, guys. It's okay. When you respawn, it looks like your cookies come back. Um, so I can eat them all over again? You betcha I can! Oh, wait, let's try not to lose at this jump. Oh, that's why I lost, because it actually moves. I didn't see that because it was kind of see-through, and I just, I couldn't see it. So, you know. It's how the cookie crumbles. Get it, cookie crumbles? <laughs> killed me till I was dead. At least I'm at the checkpoint cookie. Oh my god guys, look. It has a skull on the ones that you can't go on. Duh, that was like mega easy and I didn't even see that. Um, that is a, oh, we're playing Red Light Green Light with the creepy baby. What? Oh. What? He saw me? I'm gonna play Red Light Green Light with this crazy bratty baby. It's gonna be fine though. Green Light! He's gonna turn, he's gonna turn, he's gonna turn. I'm gonna stop. What? I stopped well. You guys saw that, right? I stopped well before he turned his head. Okay. 
All right, I have to play it safe this time. And I'm gonna keep running, running, running. I'll stop here and eat a cookie. These are good. All right, now he's gonna try to get me again. So I'm gonna stop right here. Eat another cookie while I'm waiting. Mm, those are so delicious. So if you guys want to know, you could actually end up eating two cookies each time. Whoa, look at his fingers. He's part alien, guys. That's creepy. Oh, another checkpoint cookie. Another checkpoint cookie. I ate so many of my cookies. I don't care, though. It was delicious. Oh, which treasure chest is Ooh. it? Oh, it blows you up if you're wrong. Oh, my gosh. That's harsh. You know what I do when I get scared? I eat a cookie. If you haven't slammed that like button yet, you totally should. Because this is going to be the time I figure out the right one. Yes, I just got the keys. Do, 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 do. Can I go through here then? Oh, I can. How convenient. Oh my god, everything's flooded. What a naughty baby. Wait, where am I going to go now? I'm confused by this, people. What is going on? I don't understand. Maybe go through here? Um, This is running me around in circles. Oh, I've never been to this one, I don't think. Because I don't remember the metal cage around it. While that part of the game, even though it was really easy, was very confusing, I could not figure that out at all. But now I think I got it, guys, because I don't remember this part before. Ugh. Okay, I made it. Whew. That was a lot of work. Guys, have you hit the subscribe button yet? Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It's going to be super fun. Oh, we should have followed, the, followed these guys. They knew where they were going. We're like down Ooh. in the sewers. What? Dude, the air just flew, flew out at me. That was disgusting. Oh, my God. I got to run Ooh. fast. Oh, I didn't make it again. Okay, I think what I have to do there is just be patient. That's what I have to do. Wait for it. Wait for it. Ew, that stinks so bad. This would be the time that my sister Molly would eat a cookie. She'd be like, I don't care. What's that smell? I don't care. All right, guys. I feel like we're almost out of this crazy mansion. Actually, I have no idea. I'm just hopeful. I wonder if we're going to have to fight Boss Baby at the end. Yes, we are. Oh, Big Baby Crazy. Here we go. Let's fight the Big Baby Crazy. Do, 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 fight that baby till he takes a nap. Okay, uh, my baby sister, Baby Kira, is the same. When she has to go down for a nap, she's like, nope. Don't think so. <laughs> Have you guys played this game yet? If you've played it or you want to play it, slam that like button. Okay, Big Baby Crazy, are you going to ever take a nap or what? Oh, he's getting closer. Oh, no! Poor little baby. Oh, well, sorry about that. Now I gotta eat my cookies. Guys, I think I might have just won. I'm not really sure, but I think so. I did win! Yay! Look at me! Hooray! Guys, there's a, guys, there's a really cool um, little, like, swing set over here. There's a playground. Oh, I don't have anyone to play on that with me, but... Well... <laughs> oh, I love these in real life. Let's go down the slide, see if the slide works. Slide never seems to work on these things. Whoa! That one did! It tossed me into outer space just about. Not really. That was dramatic. It just threw me on the ground. Guys, thanks so much for watching today. I love you guys so much. You're the best fans in the whole world. I'm just going to chill here after doing that uh, because it wasn't very hard, but some parts were. All right, guys. See you next time. Bye! <laughs>
My sister is so annoying sometimes. TZ, how many forks do you need to eat with a day? Uh, I don't know. Why? Because there's like a million forks in the sink, and, and, and I'm just wondering, are you making forks just so I have to wash them? Well, you quit being so grumpy about doing the dishes or Bricky's not coming over. Okay, fine. La 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 la. I hate doing chores. La 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 la. Hey guys, what's up? Oh, hey, Bricky. I'm just watching some blue guy. Molly, are you finishing your chores? Can I believe my eyes right now? I know. That was terrible. Thank goodness it's over. Don't forget to turn the water off, Molly. You don't want to flood the whole house. Yeah, Molly. <laughs> Good job, Molly. Can't believe you actually did your chores. Me either. I'm exhausted. Let's watch some TV before we do anything else. Breaking news, breaking news. We interrupt your Brook High to bring you breaking news. Oh, man. They interrupted Brook High? Well, it must be important, Molly. Shh, guys, let's listen. We wanted to tell you that there is an alarming number of children that need adoption in the adoption center downtown. Please, we can't keep up with all the food and diapers and everything these children need. Uh, some people need to come and adopt. Do it right now. And now back to Brook High. Whoa, did you hear that? Maybe we need to adopt somebody. Molly, we can't. We're not old enough. Let's just go look. I mean, maybe they have a puppy or something. I think it's kids that they're talking about, Molly. Uh, yeah, but I don't know. Let's just go look. Maybe maybe we can get, like, a little another little sister or something. Or maybe an older sister, and she can do all our chores. <laughs> that sounds like a perfect plan. Oh, Molly, sometimes you're so evil. Brookie, what are you doing? Brookie just jumped off the side of the building. She's like Spider-Man or something. Last one to the adoption center is a rotten egg. Ugh. But we could actually just go to Starbucks Coffee instead. Molly, you said you wanted to go. Yeah, but I guess Daisy didn't because she didn't follow us. Well, I guess she's not interested in adopting a kid today. I guess not. Hi, how can I help you today? Are you here to adopt someone? Um, well, we're here to find out. Mm, I'm looking for an older sister that can do all my chores. Sorry. Um, we have one child left. Really? Wow, everybody came and adopted? Yeah, it was pretty amazing. The citizens of Brookhaven are so cool. Yeah, sounds it. So, who needs adoption? It's actually a little boy. He's standing over there. His name is Billy. Oh, okay. Uh, hi, Billy. Oh, hi. I'm Molly, and this is my friend Brookie. We're gonna adopt you, since you're the only kid left, and we don't want you to be here all alone. Really? You really are going to adopt me? Yeah, just don't tell my mom because I don't think she'd like me bringing home a baby brother without her noticing. Or even wanting a baby brother or whatever. Molly, what are you talking about? I don't think this is going very well. Maybe we should just go to the pet store. What? No, I want a baby brother. He's adorable. I mean, he needs a haircut, but he's so cute. I don't need a haircut. You're rude. I'm not normally rude. Okay, yeah, I am a little bit. I'm just saying, I can't even see your eyes and your face, and you're probably adorable. Molly, leave him alone about his hair. He probably just likes it. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to seem mean or anything. I'm saying all the wrong things. I'm just really nervous right now. It's okay. You can be my big sisters if you want. Really? Okay, we'll sign the paperwork. Okay, uh, give us the paperwork. We're going to adopt this little boy. Um, wait, how old are you? Um, 30. <laughs> I'm just very short for my age. Uh, well, okay. Seems legit. Here's the paperwork. Okay, what's your name, please? Molly Acker. Molly Acker. Okay, okay. Here's the paperwork. Just continue filling out everything else. I can't believe they don't have a computer to do this. I know. So old school. All right, here you go. All finished. Your application says you were born in 1994. That would make you 29, not 30. Are you lying to me? Oh, no, it's just that my birthday's coming up in November, so I'm almost 30. Well, I guess you have a point. Molly, you need to pay attention in math class. Oh my gosh, your math is terrible. Oopsie. <laughs> okay, Billy, come on with us. Little new baby brother, you're gonna love your life. We eat a lot of cupcakes. Cool, mom's not home. She must go to the grocery store. Okay, Billy, this way. You have to stay in my room unless um, I tell you you can leave. And then, um, well, uh, it won't be for a little bit until I get the guts to tell my mom you're here and you've been adopted. Whoa, you have bunk beds? That's so cool. 
Thanks, um, but you're gonna have to sleep inside this cabinet so my mom doesn't see you. What? No way! I wanna sleep on the top bunk! That's my bed. Too bad, it's my bed now! <laughs> Where I'm telling your mom! Doody doody doody! Doody 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 head! Did he just call me what I think he called me? Doody head! Huh! Rude! Billy, you will not call me a duty head! Ha <laughs> You said duty head, duty head! Quit calling me duty head! You cannot say that or you're gonna get a timeout! You're not my mom! You adopted me as a big sister! Big sisters aren't in charge! Everybody knows that! <laughs> this kid! Ugh! Uh -huh. Ew! Did you just fart up here? No, I didn't fart! Well, okay, it was me! <laughs> I claimed your bed, duty head! <laughs> ah! He farted in my bed! This kid is so annoying! Molly, I'm home! Oh, hi, Mom! I'm just gonna go to bed now, but Boogie's gonna spend the night, okay? Um, okay, don't you girls want a snack or anything? No, we're good! This kid has to go back to the adoption center. He's being very naughty. Seriously? I thought he was gonna be the perfect baby brother. He just farted on my bed, and, and, and he called me a duty head. What? Yeah, I know, right? Molly, don't be too bummed. I know you wanted to adopt, but maybe a grown-up would be better off with Billy. He seems like he's got some things that he needs to, well, learn in life. And we're not old enough to teach him those things. What things? Your duty head? <laughs> duty head, duty head, red-headed duty head. Hey, my hair isn't totally red. It's more brown than red. And don't even try to argue with him. Just pull out your sleeping bag and try to fall asleep. Ugh. It's gonna be a long night with this kid. I just know it. Lights out, Billy! You said lights out. Just remember, you asked for this. What, for you to be quiet and stop calling me doo doo head? No, this! <laughs> Blah! It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, Daisy? Brookies? Whoever's in here? Um, Molly, Daisy's sleeping downstairs, and, um, what is that? It's Billy! He's. He's a stick figure. Okay, I'm gonna turn on the light. This is weird. Wait, did we just dream that, Molly? Um, I don't know, but did Billy also get taller? <laughs> I told you, don't ever turn off the lights. I don't know. This is all freaking me out. Oh my gosh. I'm just gonna go to bed and pretend this isn't happening. And then tomorrow you're going back to get a new home, Billy. Oh, that's just the thing. You're adopting me, it means, and it's permanent and final. Want me to turn off the light? Um, uh, uh. I'm going to, doo doo head. <laughs> ah! He's back with a stick figure again. Oh my god, and he's tall. Holy moly. And he's blinking at us, and I'm just gonna go home now, Molly. Good luck. Brookie! OMG! <laughs> you adopted me and now you're stuck with me, doo doo head! Why do you keep growing? Because I'm gonna take over Brookhaven and then the world! <laughs> oh my god, he's getting bigger and bigger and bigger! Wait a minute, if I just turn on the light, you can't be like this anymore! <laughs> you can't stay in light forever! <laughs> and then you're stuck with me! Taking over the world! There's only one thing left to do, and I'm gonna have to do it. Mom! Molly, what's wrong? Why did Brookie go running out of here? What's happening? Mom, there was this thing that I did, and I'm really messed up, and I'm really sorry. I went to the adoption center, and I adopted a baby brother. I told them I was 30, but then I gave them the wrong date, and it said I was 29, but they still believe me, and... Wait, wait, what? Yeah, but it gets worse. It gets worse than you adopting a child behind my back and not telling me? Molly, you're grounded for, like, ever. Yeah, I know, but then I found out that this this kid that I adopted isn't really a kid. It, it's an evil monster stick figure. What? What are you talking about? That sounds ridiculous. It's not, Mom. Trust me. Come here. I'll show you. Billy! Billy! His name is Billy? Molly, there's nobody here. No, I mean, when you turn on the light, he looks like a normal boy. But when you turn the light off, he turns into this creepy stick figure guy. Molly... You have pranked me twice this week already. I have no choice but to ground you. But mom, it's true! Molly, a week of grounding, no texting, and no hanging out with Brookie. If you guys saw this right, tell my mom in the comment section below. Billy was here. Billy was here! <laughs>
can't believe it. It's the day of our amazing class to it. I can't believe that we fundraised enough to all go to Hawaii. I know. This is going to be amazing. Come on, let's go get on the bus so we can go to the airport. I can't wait for this vacation. Well, it's more like a class trip, but it's still going to be amazing. Daisy, you don't think, like, the plane could crash or anything, do you? We might be going over the Bermuda Triangle. First of all, Molly, planes are very safe. They are not going to crash. Second of all, you worry too much. This is going to be the best class trip ever. So sit back and enjoy. Vacation's all I ever wanted. Time to get away. Molly, I don't think that's how that song goes. That's how it goes, Daisy. I know my songs. Bye, Molly, if you say so. What are we waiting for? Come on, we're going to miss our flight. Um, Molly, I think we're waiting for Sarah. Waiting for Sarah? What, does she need to take a limo here? Yeah, I do need to pull up in a limo because I'm that important. Duh. Excuse me, limo driver, are you going to get my bags or what? Oh, good grief. We're going to miss our flight. Come on, guys, before we miss our flight. Excuse me, hold it right there. Uh, you have to go through security first. Oh, okay. Put your bags up through this machine, please. Perfect. Now I need you to walk through that, uh, the, uh, the, oh boy. I need my coffee. Walk through this thing right here. Okay. Oh, man, it beeped. Come back through, please. Do you have anything in your pockets? Uh, no. Okay, walk through again, please. Okay, uh, uh, what is going on? You'll have to empty all your pockets. It's because she has marbles in her brain. <laughs> Did you actually think she had a real brain? She definitely has a screw loose. Sarah, real! Okay, are your pockets empty? Uh, yeah. Let's try again. Well, it seemed to work that time. Congratulations. Oh, I need that coffee. Come on, guys, hurry. We don't want to miss our flight. Oh, man, it looks like a bunch of them have been canceled. Not ours, Molly. Come on, let's go get on the plane. Whoa, we don't even have to walk. That's so fancy. I can't wait to see what the inside of the plane looks like. It's so posh. Whoa. Excuse me, you're in my seat. Uh, we didn't have a signed seating for this trip, Sarah. Yeah, my ticket says that one. Sarah, you just want to sit here because I am. It's not actually because you want to sit in this seat. Whoa, turbulence! Ugh, I don't like turbulence. Whatever, I'm going to go to the bathroom, do my hair and makeup. Okay, well, you're not getting this seat, and that's final. Molly, what's the first thing you're going to do when you get to Hawaii? Um, uh... Go poo poo! Seriously, Molly? What are you talking about? I've had to go poo poo for like 10 minutes now, and uh, I can't wait to get to Hawaii so that we can go to the bathroom. Molly, they have a bathroom on board! Yeah, but Sarah's in there and, and she's taking forever! Uh, Molly, it's still like another six hours to Hawaii. Uh, you better go knock on the door and tell her you have to go to the bathroom. Yeah, you're probably right. Sarah! Excuse me, I have to go potty, Sarah. Get out. I'm doing my hair and makeup. You've been in here for like an hour and I have to go potty. Whoa, Daisy, that turbulence is getting really bad. I don't tell me about it. Oh, it's starting to make my stomach kind of upset. You know how I told Molly this plane won't crash? Well, I've never experienced turbulence like this before. Now I'm not so sure. May I have your attention, please? We are experiencing difficulty with the plane. We suggest getting a parachute just in case you need it. Sarah, your hair looks perfect! Your makeup looks perfect! Get out of the bathroom or, or else! Or else what? Or else I'm gonna need a diaper because I have to go poo poo! Final call. Get your parachute and leave the plane. We're going to crash, people. We're going to crash! Oh my gosh, I gotta get out! I can't believe you farted. And I told you I have to go to the bathroom now. Get out. Whoa. Whoa. Why does this plane feel so weird? I don't know, but it means I can't use my curling iron. Oh, it's making me dizzy. Oh my God. 
I think this plan might crash! I gotta get a parachute! Are there any parachutes left? Oh my god, oh my god. Parachute. Well, that's good. Well, where's the rest of my class? I hope they. I hope they all survived. Wait, I don't know where I am. Is is that a? Is that an island? Oh, well, this doesn't look like Hawaii. This looks like a deserted island. Wait, is that a banana? Oh God, I'm so hungry. Hmm, this looks delicious. <sighs> and I think I saw my water bottle in my pocket from from. From when I was on the plane, I could collect water and drink it. Ew, it tastes like salt water. Oh yeah, that's right, you can't drink the ocean. Oh look, oh these must be banana trees. I need to collect all these bananas. A zombie wave has begun? Oh my God, I'm stuck on a deserted island with you? Um, well, um, yeah, I guess. Ugh. You're so annoying. I don't want to die out here with the most annoying person in the whole world. Uh, so Sarah, you're not very fun to hang out with either. What? Yes, I am. I'm amazing. Ah, Sarah, the zombies! Blah! Oh my gosh, we landed on a deserted island, but it's not deserted because it's zombie island. Ah, okay, maybe they can't go across this bridge. I mean, they're zombies, right? They're dumb. No, they can. Okay, well, we got one choice. Jump! <laughs> okay, I don't think zombies can swim, right? Yes, zombies can uh, swim, but not very well, I don't think. Oh, help me, Molly! Oh, so now you need my help. You spent all your time bullying me at school, but now that the zombies are after you? Just swim out here. They can't get you, Sarah. Zombies aren't good at swimming. Apparently, though, they can walk on water. Oh, God, we're doomed. We're doomed! I hate my life right now! Um, yeah, zombies are cray cray. Alright, I think if I go over to this part of the island, maybe they can't get me because this is a long way to swim, so. They're following me, Molly! Okay, well, do you need my help? Ugh, not really. I mean, you're so annoying. Look, Sarah, if we're gonna survive this, I think we have to decide to be best friends. <laughs> ah! Okay, fine. You can be my friend, I guess. Just protect me from the zombies. Um, okay. Right, just come up here, Sarah. They can follow you everywhere. All right, um, I think, Molly, well, think. Wait a minute. I think I have a flare gun for emergencies. <laughs> this is what you use on the plane if there's an emergency. But if you have to take down some zombies, it'll work pretty good, too. Bye-bye, zombies. You have a flare gun too? Yeah, I got it when the plane was crashing. I thought I might need it. Wow, Sarah, we make a pretty good team. I think we took down all those zombies together. You mean like we're friends? Look, if we're ever gonna get off this island, I think we have to agree to be not only good friends, but best friends. We should probably stick together because there's more zombies. And I hate to say this, but also the volcano on the island is erupting. Wait, what? You better get up to a high place. Oh, gosh. Yep. It's definitely erupting. Sarah, how are we ever going to survive this? I'm behind you, and we'll survive it because we're best friends. And we'll have each other's backs. Whoa, Sarah. I've never seen this side of you before. Well, I've never been forced to be your friend before, but I guess you're all right. Seriously, you think I'm okay? Yeah. You just think I'm cool? I didn't say that. I didn't say you were cool, but we can be friends. Wow. Okay, well, let's not be friends with these zombies. You can take these down. And then you need to get some drinking water. Um, you need to drink water. Go swim near the waterfall to get more. Okay, where's the waterfall? Follow me. I think I know. Sarah, you're not such a bad person. Well, you're still annoying, but I guess you're all right. You said that already, Sarah. I don't want to see her cool, okay? Because that would make me lame. No, it wouldn't, Sarah. All right, let's fill up our water. Well, 
glug, 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 glug. Ah, oh, that tastes so good. Plus, I needed a bath. It started to really smell. Oh. Wait, what's that? Um, I think we're supposed to um kill animals for food. What? I don't like this at all. Well, we have to survive, and I'm hungry. Come back here, chicken. You're gonna be my dinner. Get in my belly! Oh my gosh, a tsunami is coming. Don't worry about the chicken. Just save yourself, Molly. I can't have my best friend dying. Mostly because I don't want to be alone on this island. <laughs> Who would tell me I was beautiful every day? Um, yeah, uh, yeah. I'm probably not gonna tell you that anyway. What? You're my best friend. You're supposed to build me up. Okay, you're beautiful, Sarah. Now come on. Climb up this mountain before that tsunami kills us. I just wanted to have a chicken dinner. I'm so hungry. Um, all right, almost there, almost there. Yes, I made it to the very top. Wow, that is a giant tsunami. Uh, Sarah? I think I'm actually on top of the volcano. This could be bad, bestie. This could be really, really bad. Hold on, Molly. I'm coming. I'll save you. Where'd you get that chicken leg? Uh, eh. Sarah, share. I'm starving. We're not that good of friends. Sarah? Fine, you can have one bite, but trade me a banana. Okay, fine. Banana and chicken leg it is. Uh, we should probably get down from here because I bet that volcano is going to blow any minute. Um, well, we survived a week. And the only reason we did was because we became BFFs. <sighs> I thought my life couldn't get any worse. Turns out, it's terrible! I don't think it's so bad. We're here together. That's what I'm talking about. No! No! I don't want to leave Unicorn Land! I don't want to take the math test! Yet. Molly, we're gonna be late for school! Get out of bed! Huh? What? What's, what's going on? I was just in Unicorn Land. No, you were in Dreamland and dreaming about unicorns. Well, I'd like to go back there. I'm super tired. Molly, wake up! Wake up! Whoa, what's going on? A tornado! Molly, no, the lights are going on and off because I'm trying to wake you up. Now get up before I get a bucket of water and dump it on your head. You wouldn't dare! I would dare now. Get out of bed! You're gonna make us late! Huh, <sighs> you're so bossy. Has anyone ever told you that? Um, yeah, you. You tell me that all the time. <laughs> She's always so worried we're gonna be late for school. La 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 Molly, hurry up! Chop chop! Oh, she's so bossy. Do you guys have a bossy sister or brother? Slam the like button if you do! Ugh, I need to slam the like button extra for Daisy. Rude, Molly, I heard that. Why are you listening into everything I say, Daisy? Because Molly is so loud. You have the biggest mouth in the entire world. Daisy, if my mouth wasn't full of toothpaste, I'd run after you right now. But having healthy teeth is very important, so I have to keep brushing. There, now I'm finally ready for school. Took you long enough, yeah, we're totally gonna get detention, Molly. We're not gonna get detention, don't freak out. I have to remember how to get through my house, though, because we just moved in not that long ago, and I can't even remember. Take in the elevator. <laughs> this is the funniest show ever. <laughs> Dad, don't you have to work today? Yeah, but I don't have to be at my meeting until 10, so I'm just chilling. Dad, you have the best job ever. Yeah, you'd think so, but it can be stressful at times. That's why I like watching this cat show. <laughs> okay, let's go, Molly. Well, all right, we're going, we're going. Molly, you have to drive today. Wait, what? Yeah, my car's in the shop. Um, my car is, um, uh, well, I left it at Brookie's. I, I walked home because I ran out of gas. Oh, my goodness, Molly. I didn't think that was possible that you would run out of gas. <laughs> 
You're pretty gassy to me. <laughs> Daisy! All right, come on. I'll drive. We'll take Dad's monster truck. Oh, Molly, are you sure you know how to drive this thing? Um, yes and no, maybe. I don't know. Oh, boy. We're all gonna die! Ah, Molly, try to stand the road. What are you doing? Molly, slow down! Daisy, I'm seriously only going one mile over the speed limit. And you have trouble staying on the road at that speed. Seriously, Molly, you have to be the world's worst driver ever. How's that? Is that better? Yes, but you're still going way too fast. Molly, why are those lights going off behind us? Uh-oh, it looks like the police. Oh, no, Molly. Great, now we're going to get a ticket. Please pull over. Please pull over. Oh my gosh, where should I pull over at, Daisy? Over there, Molly. Just don't go too far. Oh, sure, you're going through the drive through donuts. Well, if today's got a stink, at least we'll be at the donut shop. Okay, please keep your hands on the wheel and don't exit your vehicle. I repeat, do not exit your vehicle. I will be out of the police car shortly. Oh, man, what a terrible day. Mom and Dad are never going to forgive me if I get a, if I get a ticket. What? Is that Dan's car? Well, okay. Maybe they just have the same car. License and registration, please. M Mom? Molly? What? What? Oh my gosh, Molly, you were speeding? Only like one mile over the speed limit. I I I'm late for school. Molly, that's no excuse. Uh, I had nothing to do with this. I was just riding along. Yeah, she was my accomplice. Get back here, Daisy. Please get back in the car immediately. Mom, seriously, I'm your daughter. Uh, right now, I'm a police officer, and you're somebody that I'm pulling over. Get back in the vehicle immediately, please. Um, okay. Uh, just so you know, Molly, I don't like Mom's new job as a cop. She's rude. I think she might just be doing her job. <laughs> right? <laughs> you're just doing your job. That's right. You can call me Officer Laura. Mom, I'm not going to call you Officer Laura. You're my mom. Uh, you will call me Officer Laura. No, I won't. You're my mom. That's weird. Okay, I'm going to need you to step out of the car, please. What? Why? Because you're not following my orders. Uh, do you want to buy me a donut, Mom? I mean, Officer Laura. Nope, I'm very sorry, but um, I'm going to have to arrest you. Wait, what? Yep, you didn't follow my orders and you were speeding. It's the law. I'm very sorry, Miss Molly. Mom! I mean, Officer Laura. You're going to be arrested. It's all there is to it. Can I go home? Nope, you're her accomplice. You're arrested too. Oh my gosh, this is horrible. Anything you say can be used against you. You may want to hire an attorney. Mom! I would stop calling her mom. We've got ourselves in Kuwait the Pickle, Molly. And it's all your fault. Ooh, this place now has also waffles. Mm. When I get out of the slammer, I'm definitely coming to eat here. Molly, all you think about is your stomach. Maybe we should be quiet until we get a lawyer. Molly, I can't believe it. You you sent me to jail. I'm going to be in this slammo now forever. Daisy, she's our mom. Eventually, she's going to come to our senses, right? I don't know. Mom takes her jobs pretty seriously. That's enough. That's enough chatter in there. Okay, so the prisoners aren't allowed to talk? <laughs> what kind of prison is this? The kind where Officer Laura's in charge. Okay, well... Legally, I'm allowed to make one call. Okay, here's the cell phone. You can make one call. Molly, who are you going to call? The only person that can get us out of this mess. Hello? <laughs> Who's there? I'm sorry, I'm laughing because I'm watching this cat show. Dad! Emergency! Emergency! Molly, what's wrong? What's going on? Um, I, um, I need you to, um, bail me out of jail. What? <laughs> nice prank, Molly. No, seriously. I w I've, I've been arrested. And I've been arrested as an accomplice. Okay, uh, listen, Dad. I was doing one mile over the speed limit. You were speeding? Molly! Yeah, and I was in your car. Oops. Molly! Yeah, so here's the thing, Dad. Um, Mom arrested us. What? I'll be right down. What'd you say, Molly? He just said, what? I'll be right down. In the meantime, I think we should get some uh, shot eye. Molly, you just got out of bed. Yeah, but this is really stressing me out. Good thing I packed something delicious in my backpack. Where is it now? Where is it? There it is.
Marty, you seriously gonna eat a donut at times like this? This is the perfect time to eat a donut. Mm. Delicious. <laughs> Ew, Marley, what's wrong with you? Uh, sorry, Daisy, but, uh... Marley, I'm right here in the same cell. Let me out. It's so stinky. Ew. <laughs> it's kind of gross that in the prison they put the toilet in the same room as your bed. Gross. Oh, brother. Well, here they are, Molly and Daisy. Laura, how could you arrest them? They're our own children. Well, you do the crime, you do the time. Laura, seriously? Yeah, I'm totally serious. They were doing one mile over the speed limit. Oh, come on, Laura. Usually you don't get even a ticket until you're like at least 10 miles over the speed limit. Well, I'm setting a new precedence in this in this precinct, and that is, if you do the crime... Yeah, yeah, we know. Do the time. How much money do you want to get us out of here? Um, I think the fine is $500. Holy guacamole! You girls would be doing dishes for the rest of your life to work off that one. Okay, here you go. Oh, that's $500 per daughter. Oh my gosh, Laura! You're trying to rob me! Hey, I didn't make the rules. I just work here. O-M-G. Okay, we're free. Let us out. Let us out. Ah, the taste of freedom. Now, how about going to that diner and getting another donut? Oh, brother.